offense? Well, to me, I think one of the biggest questions here is what, what was going to go on at the offense and, and what was happening at the quarterback position. And I think you know, seeing them in the spring, they definitely made strides. Wide receivers, in my opinion, have gotten so much better. You can see that the hard work that they've put in during the off season because they're, they look like they have more confidence going up after the football. So, you know, I was impressed with what I saw from an offensive standpoint and where they're going. You know, I thought they got a ton done. When you consider that they had about 140 play scrimmage, I think, yesterday, including special teams, uh, they came out in full pads. I told Coach D'Antonio I was afraid they were going to be sh in shorts and T-shirts. So, uh, obviously, we've seen more physical practices. We've seen longer practices. But I don't know that we've seen a better practice after 140 play scrimmage. Man, you know, this defense is, I mean, year in and year out. You know, it's just really a matter of how much better can they get. And you know, they're so athletic, they're so talented, particularly in the safety uh, in the corner position. The back end has so much ability back there. Linebackers, defensive linemen. Uh, Calhoun looks like he's really set to have a big year. So defense is going to keep them in a lot of games. I think it's a matter of continuing to get better there and offensively when they get into the red zone, being able to score points. I saw the best group of linebackers we've seen. Today's our fifth stop. Uh, I think I saw a deeper uh, Michigan State defense than I've ever seen. It's always been talented. Uh, but it just seemed like there's more players and, and deeper. And, you know, Max Bullard made an interesting comment, as uh, I'm sure that's not a, not a surprise, but, you know, staff continuity has allowed the team to play fast. They're not changing schemes. Uh, they know what they're doing, and I, and I think that really comes through when you watch the defensive coaches work. The things that I got answered, in the spring it looked like you were further away at running back than wide receiver. And today it just looked like it all came, it's all coming together. You certainly have enough talent for those two positions. They just got to show up and they just have to play and you have to decide on a quarterback. So I, I guess the difference for me from the spring to today is really the wide receivers and the running backs.